I've been ramped up for this for a while now. Um, I've been looking forward to it. Not to downplay it, I wasn't expecting to be in any form of awe over it. It's not every day you get to set equipment with a helicopter, especially a 1,200 horsepower helicopter. And then once you hear the it was very impressive. We have uh, two units. We have a 50-ton and a 20-ton. Uh, one is roughly almost 7,000 pounds. One is uh, a little over 3,000 pounds. Only took 15 minutes to do and weeks to prepare for. This is a cafeteria we're doing. One is serving one big part of the kitchen area. One is serving the uh, dining room area. They're self-contained units. They're straight heat with gas, no chill water. So as soon as we get the duct in and everything's wired up, we'll be ready to flip the switches, which is always exciting. We wanted to make sure that the roof was free of debris. There was nothing that with the helicopter blades turning that it wasn't gonna make anything go airborne, any type of roof debris, rubber, rubber matting, insulation from where the roofers had done anything, just any loose material in general. We did great. It was a group effort, Branch, Virginia Tech, everyone working together. Uh, and that's one of the things that makes safety run smoothly is when everyone works together as a unit. A lot of times he doesn't come up all the way on it. He just makes it light enough where we can push it into place. It's always special to work at Tech. I believe Southern Air has represented uh, Virginia Tech real well. It's just an excitement there being affiliated with, with the sports program here at Virginia Tech. All the credit does go to the team. If it wasn't for them trying to figure out everything and laying out that safety plan and again, everyone working together, it wouldn't have gone as smoothly as it did.